Good swing, good shot yet again. And getting ready for the putt. That's a birdie for McElroy. He is just so explosive. Birdie chance now for Jordan Spieth. Now two to the good side. Now up to the sixth tee. We're back against that destroyer. Frank, you need to take it over that small island? Yeah, once again, you're going to have to pick a very good target in the distance. Now, we know the shared greens at uh, St. Andrews. Well, this is actually a shared green just cut by that little sand path that goes through the middle. This green is shared with the eighth, but uh, still, this is a long par three, and for some people out there, it'll be a case of ready, aim, and driver. Appears to be a smart shot, Frank. Yeah, no problem here. That's going to fly all the way. That's well played. And now a good look at birdie. Frank, this one's not looking good. Yeah, it's certainly not down the fairway line, heading toward the rough. You have to think he'll be happy with that, given that it looked like it was headed right for the rough. Yeah, it looked like that was the only place it was going to finish, but, um, well, <clears throat> it's a little bit unexplainable. Let's see what he does from here now. Lucky break. Great sense of speed in that. We know you can make those, but that went right in the middle. No, it's that sneaky distance. Wow, what a birdie. Frank, looking at this hole, a player is going to need a detailed map from high above, maybe from the bomber squadron flying overhead, just to get a sense of what they're trying to navigate. You can always go up in uh, one of those two lookout towers, just check the direction of the wind, see which way it's coming from, but not an overly long par three. Frank, still relatively early in the round, but given what we've seen so far, this could be a heck of a golf round. Yeah, right now, everything's just going according to plan. It's like he's playing on all eight cylinders. So really, you're just trying to get out of your own way.
seems to like it. Headed for the fat part of the green. Trying to generate some momentum here at the seventh hole. This for birdie. Moving a little bit to the right. Boy, this could be a tough one right here, Frank. It's a very long putt, Rich. Obviously, it's difficult, uh, but he still has a shot to sink this one for birdie. That would have been a real bonus had it dropped, but as it is, good putt. You don't want to let this one get away. This is about concentration and focus at this point. That was cruel. That looked like it was certainly going in. This for Jordan Spieth's birdie. Good try, just didn't quite read the break, Frank. Uh, it shouldn't be a problem, you'd think, cleaning up here for pop. Trying to stay steady, make a par. Knocks that putt in for par to stay at three under. Just a tap in to finish the hole. That puts them at four under for the round. Now to the eighth hole, Frank, you really just need to follow the trail down to the green here at Paracel Storm. Uh, barracks are probably the, the biggest problem that in front of you. They're just short and left of this par three green. For the very observant, though, they'll notice a little one-on-one, -on -one, perhaps a little basketball court just along the left side. A little three-point shooting contest, you and I later on? This is a par three. Frank, this one's offline. There's rough and thick stuff over there. Pretty good result right there, considering... It looked rough all the way, Exactly. Rich. It really did. Be safely on deck. And it's a long way to the hole from here. Never easy. How does that not go in? Amazing. Stroke looked good. Uh, line looked good. Just did not take that final break. This one just requires a little bit of focus. Really has a feel on these greens. That is another birdie. This is impressive. 
that is a solid par putt. Frank, it's been a real battle out here so far on the front nine. Let's uh, finish it off in style here. There's a great view just slightly right of the ninth green. Look out. Now, that's full of people. You might get the appropriate applause, maybe even a standing ovation. At least a salute. 150 yards approximately to that flag, but you have to be precise. And let's see how precise you can be. That's an outstanding shot right there, and it sets up a really good look at birdie. Spieth trying to light the fuse. This one's for birdie. Very well done. Almost made it. Yeah, there'll be no stress for the next one. Not a gimme, but well within his range. Continues to amaze yet another birdie, and what a day it's been. Just a couple of feet. Keeps the momentum going with that putt. Stays at three under. Excellent front side, trying to keep it going here on the second nine. He's just playing beautifully, hitting so many good shots, giving himself so many opportunities. Can he keep it going? Frank, what's so compelling about rivalries in sports is that athletes need each other if they're going to go to great heights. Joe Frazier needed Muhammad Ali to solidify his legend. Jack Nicklaus probably needed Arnold Palmer to go to a place that he had not been. And I think that's true across the board as we look at rivalries in sports. I think it defines careers, Rich. Uh, it's not until those players retire that they realized how important it was to have that, that foe. You know, so often we're we're living in the presence in the present, like we are now with Tiger Woods and Rory McIlroy, and it's not for years to come that we'll realise the sport wouldn't have been the same with one without the other. Moving a little to the right of the flagstick. Getting set now over the putt. Oh, another one goes in. Looking to make a move. This putt for birdie. Continuing to play well. Minus seven now after that putt. 11th hole here at Paracel Storm, now a military playground. Frank, certainly the players are thankful having traded the guns for golf clubs. Good time out there so far.
A little bit of an obstacle course, though, here at 11. You can see the weather vanes that adorn the right side of this hole. Tee shot has to be played across that seawall. So once again, all carry. And let's see if he can land softly on the other side. Here's to be what they call a commercial play. Very solid. Not terrible, but not his best. Yeah, outside chance, really, for uh, for Birdie, but um, really, it was a, a rather poor approach shot. Pretty long putt right here. You'd be happy to get it to within two, three feet. Always two components to the long lag putt, the speed, number one, and then the read, and missed out on that second part. just slides by. Yeah, can't afford to miss too many of those out here today. This a par bid for Jordan Spieth. In for par, and will sit tight at four under. He can really get red hot with a putter. Let's see what McElroy does. Just an amazing display. The records continue to fall. This is a daunting tee shot, isn't it? This has to be hit perfectly. Surely not. That's how you play the game, right there. Stick it in close and then knock in the birdie. off the beaten track that's got five minutes to find it he'll need to be strong with this These putts keep the round together. Oh my gosh, that hurts. Well, there's an opportunity wasted. Just knocking him for a par and let's forget about this one. Um, golf is not about perfect, but it is gonna hurt the course. 
A lip out's fine as long as it doesn't happen to you. So they'll tap in. Did the job right there. So not his best work. He'll walk away with a bogey. Here we are now at the 13th, and Frank, this is a stout-looking hole. Rich, it certainly is. No time to be superstitious on uh, number 13. The trenches, they protect the back and the right of this green. Anything left of that, time to call in the Navy. Good swing, good shot yet again. That's one of the more depressing sights in golf. You've hit a good one, and then it just sucks back too much spin off the green. Well, that's how you do it. Hit it close, take the pressure off that putt. That one should be no problem. Remember, out of the rough. Expect the ball to jump forward a little bit. Oh, my goodness, he just made that. I cannot believe it. I was thinking he might get it close. <laughs> and... Just a great shot. Now to seven under par. Frank now at the 14th and really a simple objective here. It looks like an old sand dune where they've just put a green on top. Uh, rather benign. Might just sneak up on you though. It really just looks like green and beaches with a few palm trees behind, but beware. Good chance at one. Midway through this back nine could use this birdie here at the 14th. 160 yards. Frank, you played in conditions all over the world. Here come the winds now. What's the mindset? Well, this is really what separates the men from the boys. This is where you've got to tell yourself, and it's an advantage to you. Um, obviously, the scores will go up a little bit, um, given the conditions, but once again, this is going to suit the stronger player today. You like the old phrase, swing easy when it's breezy? Definitely when you're hitting it into a head breeze. But um, if down breeze, tee it up a little bit, try and ride that wind some more.
Good looking shot right here. Been pretty good all day from this distance, just trying to take care of business. Hard putt, soft hands, beautiful roll. Pretty chance now for Jordan Spieth. Good chance here. Currently at five under par. Impressive. Once again, that's a par. Remaining at five under. Now to the 15th hole. Danger in the center of the green here, Frank. Yeah, chance to ambush the player, really. All those trees there. And uh, what well, we've seen the sixth hole at Riviera with the bunker in the middle. We now have a crop of trees. Frank, this golf course is surrounded by water, just a few tiny islands strung together to create these 18 super cool looking par threes. Yes, Rich, and, and with all that water comes a lot of lost balls. Uh, when this base was still active, many of the soldiers would play the course in the tee box. They just get backed up really quickly. It was so bad that they created a local rule for balls in the water. So if you hit your ball in the water, you do what they've always done. You just drop one up next to the green and you take a stroke penalty. Pretty good roll. That is a beauty, a real beauty. About 120 yards to the hole. Oh, solid strike right in the heart of the green. Really not much to this. The only issue would be a lack of concentration or focus.
You may have lost track at home, but we're keeping count, and that is nine under for the day. Over the putt, this is Jordan Spieth. Continues to amaze yet another birdie, and what a day it's been. Just take a look out at the battleships burning, the solar panels, the bridges, the barracks. You know you're not at your dad's country club anymore. Frank, I think that went in. It's a what? It's a hole in one. He made an ace that is unbelievable. see a little bit off balance on the tee and that one is going to be in the rough you have to think he'll be happy with that given that it looked like it was headed right for the rough yeah it looked like that was the only place it was going to finish but um well <clears throat> it's a little bit unexplainable let's see what he does from here now lucky break 17th hole now at paracel storm and frank as we come toward the end of this round you really want to salute the caddies as well as the players that's right. They've gone out there with meal packs today and canteens to make sure that there's uh, the right amount of sustenance. But if you're looking for victory, then a strong finish is needed. Good chance for a birdie here at 17. Uh, you've got to uh, traverse, obviously, the water there. And without the help of the Navy today, this is going to have to come in nice and high and soft, a little bit like a paratrooper coming in down there to avoid all those trees and palm trees that protect the front and the right side of this par 3. There's a big green, and they're going to use every inch of it. Good chance now for a birdie. That was an outstanding play. Well, it's almost a guarantee there after that shot. This one just requires a little bit of focus. Just missed a hole in one. MOG astonished face. Moves to minus eight. Just a couple of feet. In for birdie. Now the finishing hole, Frank, and just a spectacular looking hole. Yeah, chance to complete our mission should we succeed here at 18. If anything, you want to keep the ball a little left of the flag. Otherwise, we're off the beach.
appears to be tracking well. Oh, just a superb shot. You're not going to see much better than that all day today. Flop Master Maeve. Appears to be a smart shot, Frank. Yeah, no problem here. That's going to fly all the way. Birdie chance now for Jordan Spieth. Wow, that was so close, Frank. Just time to forget that one. I mean, he couldn't hit that much better. Second shot. I mean, almost hard to believe. 13 under already. Hut for par. He needs one. Well, no problems there. Yeah, keeps the round going. Keeps the momentum on his side. Frank, you have to like what you saw out there today. I certainly did. Uh, swing is excellent right now. Stroke, there's nothing wrong with that. Really, just it's a case of getting out of your own way. Uh, I mean, the opportunities ahead now, chance to win, just um, they have to be so motivating. 